Hey, what's going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is DRL. We are back with some NBA 2K Mobile. And folks, we have just completed the mini gauntlet event, and it is that time to claim our daily login rewards. So we're going to be getting some new pearls, some topaz, and some jade cards added to our squad. So I'm going to jump into my collection because we actually pulled some players already. As far as topaz, I did get Kawhi Leonard off the draft board, so I was really excited about that. As far as Jade cards, I got Shake Milton, which I got from the drill pack, which definitely caught me off guard. So that was a nice surprise. And as far as pearls, these are the players that I got from completing the tourneys. So we got as our point guard, John Morant. My shooting guard is Evan Fournier. Small forward is Mikael Bridges. Power forward is Chris Bosh, which is actually a gem card. One of my favorite cards from, I think it was season three when he first came out, or might've been season two, I can't recall. And Moses Malone, who's another gem as well. Very solid rebounder and defender for head to head. So that's what I got so far. Let's jump into mini gauntlet and claim our rewards. Of course, as always, let me know in the comments who you pulled for the mini gauntlet. First card is going to be a Jade. We got another Shake Milton. Honestly, I was expecting to get another player, but at least we can upgrade Shake Milton. We got these collectibles so we can craft some players. And let's talk about the crafting. There's some really good players that you could craft for the all NBA theme if you have leftover rings from season four. Right now I can craft a pink diamond Kevin Durant, a dark matter Dwayne Wade, or a galaxy Opal Russell Westbrook. We got more collectibles there too, but I might be saving up to try to craft that LeBron or that Steph Curry, because there's a Topaz LeBron and a Jade Steph Curry that could be crafted. And here goes our Pearl, who we getting here. We got Kemba Walker. So we got two point guards now. John Morant would be the better player out of the two. So those are the pros we got. Let's jump into our daily login and hopefully we can pull some heat. So go right into the stat line. Now we didn't claim our rewards at the end of season four, so which actually worked out greatly because now our first reward is going to be a dark matter. Then we get a topaz, a jade, and then two pearls, which is real fine. So every pull here is a solid rarity. Just hopefully we get some good players. So here goes our first pull. It's a dark matter. Who we getting here? Come on, baby, come on. We got George Gervin, the Iceman. This is a good pull. One of the good small forwards in this game. All right, let's check out the Topaz. Who we got? Come on, baby, come on. We got here Tyus Jones. Here goes our Jade. Come on, come on, come on. RJ Barrett, I'm happy about that, Knicks Nation. And he's a gem, he's actually a really good card in this game. That's what's up. All right, here goes our pearls. Come on, come on, come on, let's get some fire. Spin that round. We got Mikal Bridges, which is good, right? We could upgrade the other one we have. Here goes our last one, who we gonna get here? Come on, come on, come on. Who we got? DeJounte Murray. It's actually a good card. Very good defender. I actually think he's great for head-to-head. -to, -head. to clamp up the scoring point guards like Stephen Curry, Damian Lillard, Trey Young. He's a good defender. I like DeJounte Murray. So those are the pros we pulled. Now, we also completed our court side pass. So we'll be able to claim everything here. And at the end of this is the court side ultra, which could get us a good pull as well. So let's see what we get. We got five draft picks. Look at all the rings, like this is, I'm really feeling the draft board this year. D'Angelo Russell. So again, next courtside pass is coming on October 1st. And it should be pretty fire. The rarity I don't know yet. But last month was a dark matter. It could be a topaz, I'm still not sure. But either way, just for off the coins and everything else, it's good value. We got here Terrence Mann. All right, we got a courtside super. Who we gonna get in here? Spencer Dinwiddie, courtside super again. And we got a Amethyst Mono Ginobili. Now that's a good pull. I'm actually surprised that the theme cards are also included inside the courtside pass packs. That's actually pretty cool. Theme collectibles, <laughs> Halloween theme. We got a DeAndre Hunter. Courtside Super once again. We got Rui. There he goes. Another random collector. This is for the finals 2022. 
Got the Onyx Devin Booker. Now make sure you log in for seven days to get the Onyx Shaquille O'Neal. Next set of random collectibles, the Champions theme, Diamond Scotty, that's a gem. We got a good amount of coins on the grind, King of the Court. All right, random collectibles. We've got New Year's 2022 and All-Star 2022. And here goes our last courtside ultra. What we got here, we got an Emerald Christian Wood. But the reason why I got this courtside pass is to get this legend on my squad, LeBron James. So we got that Dark Matter LeBron James courtside pass version, which always gives you 10% style bonus. So if you are grinding the event, you can use any of these courtside players to get a style point bonus, which is super helpful. All right, so let me know in the comments what you pulled from your daily logins, your mini gauntlet rewards, and if you got any good pulls from the courtside pass. Are you hyped for next month? Let me know in the comments as well. As always, I appreciate all the support. I catch everybody on the next one. Peace out.